Telecommunications in Ghana include radio, television, fixed and mobile telephones, and the Internet. Telecommunications is the main economic sector of Ghana according to the statistics of the World Bank due to the Ghana liberal policy around information and communications technology Among the main sectors of investments, 65% is for ICT, 8% for communications and 27% is divided for public administration. Topic: Radio and Television. In 2007, Ghana was served by one state-owned TV station, two state-owned radio networks, several privately owned TV stations, and a large number of privately owned radio stations. Multiple international broadcasters and several cable and satellite TV subscription services were also available. In 2010, there were 140 authorized radio stations with 84 in operation and 32 authorized television stations with approximately 26 in operation. Television broadcasters include First Digital TV, ATV, BTA, Faith TV, Channel D, Star TV, FTV, Sports 24, CINIMAX, Planet Kids, TV Africa, Metro TV, TV3, GTV, GH1 TV and Viasat 1. The Ghana Broadcasting Corporation GBC, founded by decree in 1968 is the state agency that provides civilian radio and television services. It was created for the development of the education and entertainment sectors and to enhance the knowledge of the people of Ghana. Freedom of the press After the overthrow of the elected government by Jerry Rawlings in December 1981 the Provisional National Defence Council repealed the liberal media reforms of previous governments, abolished the Third Constitution and the Press Commission, and passed laws that prevented criticism of the government or its policies, dismissed editors critical of Rawlings or the Provisional Council, the preventive custody and newspaper licensing law which allowed indefinite detention of journalists without trial, and the newspaper licensing law which stifled private media development. Ghanaian press freedom was restored with the promulgation of a new constitution in 1992, presidential and parliamentary elections in November and December 1992, and a return to multi-party democratic rule on 7 January 1993. The mass media of Ghana today is among the most liberal in Africa, with Ghana ranking as the third freest in Africa and 30th in the world on the 2013 World Press Freedom Index from Reporters Without Borders. Article 21 of the Constitution of Ghana guarantees freedom of the press and other media, freedom of speech and expression, thought, and information. Telephones <inaudible> 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 The prefix code of Ghana for international calls is plus +233. As of 2012, there were 285,000 fixed telephone lines in use, 120th in the world, and 25.6 million mobile cellular lines, 42nd in the world. The telephone system is outdated with an unreliable fixed line infrastructure heavily concentrated in Accra and some wireless local loop installed, domestic trunks primarily use microwave radio relay. There are four Intelsat Atlantic Ocean satellite earth stations. Microwave radio relay links Ghana to its neighbors 2009, the SAT-3, WASC, Main-1, 
GLOW-1, and ACE International Optical Fiber Submarine Cables provide links to countries along the west coast of Africa and on to Europe and Asia. In 2010, two fixed line and six mobile phone companies were authorized to operate in Ghana, of which five were operating, 13 satellite providers were authorized, of which eight were operating, 176 VSAT providers were authorized, of which 57 were operating, and 99 public and private network operators were authorized of which 25 were operating. Authorized telecommunications companies include Mobile Telecommunications Networks Mountain, Vodafone Ghana which purchased Telecom Ghana, Tigo which replaced Mobitel, Milicom International Cellular, Bharti Airtel and Zane which acquired Western Telesystems Limited, Westel, Glow Mobile Ghana Limited and Expresso Telecom which acquired Kasapa Telecom. In 2017, Tigo Ghana and Airtel Ghana merged to form Airtel Tigo. Competition among multiple mobile cellular providers has spurred growth, with a mobile phone teledensity in 2009 of more than 80 per 100 persons and rising. The cost of mobile phones is increased by taxes of around 38%. Topic: Internet. The top-level domain of Ghana is GH. Ghana was one of the first countries in Africa to connect to the internet, with an average household download speed of 5.8 megabits per second. Ghana had the third fastest speed on the African continent and the 110th fastest out of 188 countries worldwide in February 2014. In 2009, the number of internet users stood at 1.3 million, 93rd in the world. In 2012 the number of internet users reached 4.2 million 69th in the world or 17.1% of the population 149th in the world in 2012 there were 62124 fixed 109th in the world 0.3% of the population 156th in the world and 8.2 million wireless 27th in the world 33.3% of the population 49th in the world broadband subscriptions in 2012 there were 59086 internet hosts operating in Ghana 93rd in the world and Ghana had been allocated 332544 IPv4 addresses 102nd in the world world, with less than 0.05% of the world total, and 13.2 addresses per 1,000 people. In 2010 there were 165 authorized Internet service providers of which 30 were operating. <laughs> Internet censorship and surveillance There are no government restrictions on access to the Internet or reports that the government monitors email or Internet chat rooms without judicial oversight. Individuals and groups engage in the peaceful expression of views via the Internet, including by email, although the Constitution and law provide for freedom of speech and press, the government sometimes restricts those rights. The police arbitrarily arrest and detain journalists. Some journalists practice self-censorship. The Constitution prohibits arbitrary interference with privacy, family, home, or correspondence, and the government respects these prohibitions in practice. In 2002, the government of Ghana censored internet media coverage of tribal violence in northern Ghana. Topic. See also 
Ghana Internet Exchange GIX New Media in Ghana Media in Ghana Terrestrial Optical Fiber Cable Projects in Ghana Internet in Ghana Topic Further reading Johnny Akakpo October 2008 Rural Access Options and Challenges for Connectivity and Energy in Ghana PDF International Institute for Communication and Development IICD and Ghana Information Network for Knowledge Sharing GINKS P 41